Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is California Guardian. I'm back out here at the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department Twin Towers Correctional Facility. And I don't know if you can see it in the darkness, but it's the uh, Los Angeles County Sheriff's Men's Central Jail. Just out here. Checking it out. If you guys know I was here once before, got a little argument with one of the guards, our deputies, off duty deputy, in plain clothes. What we're going to do here today is we're just going to do a real quick audit. It's about 2 30, 3 o'clock in the morning. So, oh, just thought that I would come out here. Uh, had some car problems, so had to take the bus to come to work. And I got here a little early for work, which of course means that, uh, well, I got I drive a truck, so. But there we go. So we're over here. You guys remember from my last video I'm not going down Bouchard Street I'm staying over here on Vigness there's of course the ever-present uh, bail bondsmen that seem to haunt across the street from jails and police stations. More bell bondsmen over that way. That's a horrible noise, whatever that is. So this is the entry and exit gate for law enforcement vehicles bringing inmates in, or transporting them out. Wow, that noise is horrible. Hopefully it doesn't last too long. Authorized personnel only. There's another authorized personnel only sign right there. Across the street, we got the walk clear right there. I think that noise is going to drive me crazy. I can imagine how much it's going to drive you guys crazy. So I am going to um, probably walk further down to another part of the, uh, of the jail. GPS. <laughs> So it's a little bit different than me. I do daytime, uh, late afternoon, early evening, before it's dark uh, audits, except for the one that I did in Pomona with a High Desert Community Watch. Uh, so this will be my first night audit by myself. We'll see how it goes. It's kind of dark and uh, might be kind of hard to make it out, but uh, hopefully we can 
get a good visual of this. As we continue to walk. So this is actually Bushart Street. There goes the deputy sheriff driving his car down the street with no lights on. Well, parking lights anyways. So there's the uh, jail lit up at night. Well, here is, I guess, this is the considered the front door of the jail. It says uh, 450 Bashed Street, Inmate Reception Center, Public Library, Community Reentry and Resource Center, Cashier's Office, DNA Collection Site, Property Release. There goes a sheriff's van right there. You guys remember correctly, last time I was here, This is the parking lot where I had the discussion with the off-duty uh, deputy sheriff that was leaving who said that I cannot go beyond this point. I am going to now challenge that, of course, because this sign and this sign is for this driveway. I've gone beyond that sign and there's a deputy sheriff over there parked in the vehicle. Now, I will 
grant that probably beyond this point, as you can see, that becomes beyond where I can go. This is the area here where I was told by the one guy that I could not go, and here I am. And there is a deputy sheriff in that vehicle right there who has said nothing. I believe that over there is the employee's entrance and exit point. So there is an LA County Sheriff's uh, inmate bus to take people to court or to the other uh, county camp. There's a deputy running to work. So we're going to go ahead and pause this so as not to use up too much time. Okay, so what we're going to do is we are going to uh, walk across this crosswalk right here on the other side. Well, this is actually where the old Men's Central Jail used to be. Well, they still use it, but everybody goes through the Twin Towers and they have to actually have an underground tunnel and they have this tunnel here on this catwalk. There we go. Better view. There's a sheriff's vehicle going in there.
That is Homeland Security coming out of the Sheriff's Department. 